Hey there, I want to show you some stuff you can do with the new ref growth tool feature that will hold extra um, variables in a string. So here you have the links as you can create them. The first one over here is the one that's actually pretty basic that everybody can use now. And the second one, uh, the one over here, that is one where you can uh, put extra variables in the string and we just split them up and you can write them uh, or save them into your own custom user fields. So let's start. I will click the second one. A link could look like this and there we go. That will bring me to the start of this flow. Good to see you. Are you looking for your stats or do you need a link to refer users to our system? So what you can do is you can click the first one, which will show you the section that was there in the beginning. Here's your personal link and some information about the extra fields you can add to it. And if you click this link, okay, I want to do that. How can I do it? You just get some information of how to get there. Now the cool part is, you can also look at your statistics and these are here. Show me some stats. And if you click that button, there you go. We're sending you to our special stats overview. Would you like to see them? Yes. Okay. Hold on. And there we go. Thanks Jeff and Levi for testing the button for me. Appreciate it. And there we go. I've sent four people. Um, I deleted myself once. That's why it says four and not three. And here you can see the var one, two, and three. Those are the extra um, variables I put in the string. So we split them up and we wrote them to each their own custom user field. So you can keep track of whatever you want. So that's that. What's also pretty cool is that you can actually type in, it's just a keyword trigger, but you can just say show refs whenever you are in the social source flow or the one of your business. And then it will also trigger the stats flow. Let me just put it like this. Okay, hold on. Thanks again, Jeff and Levi. And as you can see, it will show you the statistics again. So that's pretty cool. And this is just the way it works. It works fine. One little thing, the dates over here, they uh, reference the last active date. So if uh, in this instance, I joined before Levi, for example, uh, but Levi hasn't been active and I have, then I will show up as the first one because the September 11th is the last active date for me. So that's how it works. It works fine. It's pretty cool to do. And now you can just keep track of um, who sends traffic and how much. Thank you.